What's up YouTube, this is iTweaks here and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to save offline maps in Google Maps 2.0. Now it's actually pretty simple, all you have to do is open up your Google Maps and you can see, first of all let me point out that I am in airplane mode already. So that means I have no internet connection whatsoever, but you're going to be able to see that I am able to pull up parts of the map and that is because I have already saved them in offline mode. So I'll show you right now that I've saved Dallas area. So you can see I can zoom in just like that and it's going to give me all of the details of all the roads and everything. So let's go ahead and zoom out. I also saved New York City. So let's go to New York. And you can see that I have the maps there as well. Now I'm going to show you how to do this. It's actually really simple. So I'm going to go ahead and turn airplane mode off so I have a Wi-Fi connection. Now we're going to go back to Google Maps and we're going to type in, uh, let's go with, let's just go with Ohio. Ohio is good enough, right guys? So we'll zoom in right here and while it loads, there's no streets in Ohio. Okay, there they are. All right, so we're just going to zoom out just a little bit and then to save this, all we have to do is type in OK space maps then we're gonna hit search and then it's gonna give you this little animation right here it says preloading map and then once this is done loading you're gonna get a little banner down here I'll show you the on-screen map area has been cached so that means that this area now is completely available offline so I'm gonna go ahead and go to airplane mode once again now we're going to go back into the Google Maps. And I am going to go to Ohio just to show you guys. So you can see here that all the roads are still showing up and that's because this map is available offline. I'll also show you one that I pulled up in Florida. And I saved as well. So you can see that it works pretty well. So if you're going to be traveling and you don't want to deal with data roaming charges and you need to save some offline maps, this is definitely one way to go. So let me know what you guys think about this feature in the comments below. And if you enjoyed this video, please hit that like button. If you want to see more of my videos, then go ahead and subscribe. Alright guys, until next time, this is iTweaks with iPhoneHacks.com.